This is a rare opportunity, this opportunity to have some seclusion, to find some time for yourself, to get to know yourself. All too often we know ourselves through our interaction with other people. And we don't know which part is them and which part is us. We tend to pick up their ideas and, without even knowing it. So it's good to get out, to look at yourself, and realize, of course, there are lots of yous in there, lots of different people, lots of different voices you've picked up from who knows where, and you've got to sort out which ones you want to listen to right now. And as we're meditating, we're trying to create a couple of new identities inside. You want to be a really good observer. And you want to be curious about what your mind is doing. All too often a mental process yields a thought or yields a feeling. And we just run with a thought and run with a feeling without really stepping back to look at the process. So that's what you've got to look into. That's what you've got to watch. That's what you've got to question. How did we get there? How did that come about? It's like going to under a factory and instead of being interested in what actually comes out of the factory, going in looking at how they put it together. Because many times in a factory, and when it comes out of the factory, it's all dressed up nicely and it's packaged and everything. It looks really nice. And then you look carefully on the, on the label and it says processed food product. They can't even call it food. It's a food product. And you say, well, yeah, let's go back and look what's, what they're making this food product out of. And you find all kinds of things you would never want to eat, but they've been dressed up. That's when you realize, okay, I don't want to eat that food product ever again. Well, it's the same with the mind. A lot of our feelings, a lot of our ideas have been dressed up as idea products. But when you look at how they actually got put together, you realize you wouldn't want to go with it. So that's what you want to look into. That's the part of the mind you really want to develop, the one that's interested in the process, interested in taking it apart, so you don't fall for all the junk food that your mind has been creating for itself for who knows how long. So it's only when you have some time by yourself that you actually do this. Otherwise, the press of other people, their pressure to have you do something or say something or think something right now doesn't give you the chance to watch the process. You just run with whatever product comes out. So here's your chance to get to know the factory and decide if you want to close it down or which factories you want to keep going. And it's, you're the inspector now. <laughs>